So we have to uh, determine the formula units, a uh, 0.12 milligrams sample contains. So to develop a plan, um, we have mass, we have milligrams of sodium chloride. We can convert to grams of sodium chloride. Then we can convert to moles of sodium chloride and then we can convert to um, <clears throat> formula units so to go from here we know that there are 1000 milligrams in one gram here we need the molecular weight of sodium chloride which is so we have chloride, which is 35, and sodium, this is 58.4 grams per mole. And then here we use Avogadro's number. So um, Avogadro's number is, uh, a little bit long, but it's 6.022 times 10 to the 23. Um, this is molecule, formula units, or pure mole. So let's go ahead and Keep our plan visible for now. And let's start the problem. So we have 0.12 milligrams of sodium chloride. Now we know that there are 1,000 milligrams in one gram. Then we have grams in the top, so we use the molecular weight, which was 58.4 grams of sodium chloride in one mole of sodium chloride. Then in one mole of sodium chloride, there is 6.022 times 10 to the 23 formula units. So now we do the math. Do the math. This is Okay, I have a result of 1.24 times 10 to the 18 formula units of sodium chloride. And let me just corroborate and I'll be back with the correct, make sure it's correct. Maybe there are 1,000 divided by 58.44 multiplied by 6.022 times 10 to the 23. And the answer is correct.